Good morning everyone! Super excited with this unboxing. So we have the Oakley Factory Pilots. For those of you that know what this is, you'll know why I'm super excited. If you don't, stick around and you'll see why I'm super excited for these. So these are the Oakley Kados. They were introduced, the 24K version was introduced during the uh, Tokyo Olympics this last summer. So let's take a look at this. And uh, they've been, the gold ones have been sold out forever, but my fiance managed to get a pair of these black ones. Uh, all the other colors are sold out still. So I managed to get a pack of these, so we'll take a look at what's inside the packaging. Alrighty, so what do we have? We have two uh, nose piece replacements. We have the standard microfiber bag. We have the warranty information, and lastly we have the sunglasses themselves. So I haven't really followed Oakley that recently because there haven't been really a lot of uh, cool designs out there, but this one is an exception. Uh, typically I don't personally buy plastic framed Oakleys. When I was small, in my teenagers, when I bought, bought my first uh, pair of uh, Oakley eye jackets, I just didn't like the fact that they could snap so easily and you lose all the money from your investment. Uh, this is an exception, but uh, if you look, I'll show you a video of my collection of Oakleys and you'll see a predominantly uh, theme that they are all metal framed glasses. So after this video, I'll, I'll show you my collection and you'll see from the video that I predominantly choose metal frames over plastic frames. Alright, so let's uh, open this up. So, first comes with a nice Oakley um, case here. Slightly different from the standard uh, Oakley, like the interweaved hard shells, but this is still a hard shell here. And there they are. So, what's unique about this pair of Oakleys is that the bridge, the nose bridge, is this is all actually one piece. This whole, the whole glass is actually one, the whole lens is actually one entire piece. Uh, they say that it's, it will minimize the distortion. And you see here, the, it comes with another one. So it comes with three different nose. Uh, so I guess no different size, are they different sizes? Yeah, they seem to be different sizes, so they come with three different sizes of the uh, the nose piece here. Really nice pair of lenses. They are prism. I don't think they're polarized, but that doesn't matter. At least to me, it doesn't matter. Okay, so one little design difference that this these uh, glasses have is that you can pull out this and adjust the angle oh so slightly. It's not even a significant adjustment and taking this off is I heard is extremely difficult so let me try this out. I don't want to break this pair. You saw the price on it. Uh, let's see if I can take this out and show you. They say it's super easy, but you can see it's not that easy. Okay, so I managed to get it off. So basically this comes out. There's three little three little pegs there. And then the, the, the holes there so you can adjust. You can see, you can adjust it, but it's hardly noticeable, the adjustment. I guess for people with maybe big heads, I, I have no clue. Uh, they, they might want to adjust it, but it, it's hardly an adjustment at all. And then um, you just basically fit it back in there. And it just goes back in and then that's locked in again. So that's what that um, 
that mechanism does. And besides that, there's not a whole lot different from um, other ones. All one piece. And that's really about it. Okay, so well, thanks for watching this unboxing of my Oakley Kato uh, black lenses here. And uh, check out my videos. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll try to do more videos in the future. And um, as a little bonus, as I mentioned earlier in the video, I'm going to show you my collection of uh, Oakleys. Have a great day. Okay, I'm actually back with one last thing. Um, it's a little odd and I didn't even realize this until I took it out. So I assume that the microfiber bag that the glasses come with uh, typically it's just going to be an oversized ones like the ones the M frames or the bigger ones use. But something a little odd I noticed on this one. This one has a little flap here and it has a pocket but the pocket does not go through the bag itself so I don't know what that is actually for. I'm assuming maybe it's to put the replacement uh, nose pieces in here just in case of emergencies because it doesn't go through the other side but it's there. It's a little bag, a little flap here that opens up into a secondary little uh, bag there. So something interesting that I've never seen before with Oakley but uh, could mean one thing is that it'll be really expensive for you to maybe replace these ones if you need if you lose these, you know, I don't know, you, it might or might not be functional for you. I originally thought maybe when you put these in that the the arms will stick out, or one of the arms will stick off on this side, but it's not the case. This is a sep completely separate pocket in here. Again, don't know why it's there. But yeah, just a little extra little thing that um, I'm not used to that I just noticed when I was taking the bag out to uh, actually put the glasses into. Right. Well, again, thank you and uh, check out the next video. So here's my collection of Oakleys. You can see I even have the double wide uh, display for it, official one. I'm not going to say where I got it, but yeah, that's the official display case. And here are all my Oakleys. See, I wasn't kidding when I told you guys that I was uh, madly a big fan. I wasn't kidding when I told you I was a big fan of Oakleys. I've been buying these Oakleys since I've been in high school till now, and these are my this is my basically my collection. Well, again, thanks for watching, everyone. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I hopefully will provide you with more and new content going forward.